Surrey has always been driven by technology. Even the earliest technologies, the Gunther chain or the steel tape, that was a big innovation, right? And so that went from people tying knots to steel tapes that actually had numbers on it. So it kind of innovated the profession. Then you, in the early 90s, GPS became readily available. Well, you went from having three to four man survey crews to two man survey crews because it just made you that much more efficient. You didn't have to rely on people tied to the ground. You could have GPS units. You fast forward a little bit further. Now you have robotic total stations, right? So instead of somebody behind the total station, it's now looking for a prison pole. That's a big deal for like one, two small shops because now you don't have to have two men on a crew. You can get away with one man on a crew. Moving forward, you, you hear the buzzwords of AI and drones. And, and I can see a world where you launch a drone from some place, it collects a lot of data and it returns home, you download the data, you push it into a system and the system automatically processes and generates deliverables. I think you're always gonna have a boots on the ground approach to find certain things and validating things, but the future is gonna be driven by AI and artificial intelligence. Uh, I think that is the future. And I don't think that's just survey. I think that's across the board what we're gonna end up seeing. Repetitive tasks being replaced with just algorithms.